All right, here's the third video for this chapter. <clears throat> it's the same as the last video in that they want the point slope form of the line and the slope intercept form. And the information is a little bit different. Here they give us the x intercept and the y intercept. Of course, I'm going to use these two pieces of information to find the slope first. All right, so the x intercept is happening at 4, 0. And the y-intercept happens at 0, negative 2. All right, so my slope is just negative 2 minus 0 over 0 minus 4. And that is just positive 1 half. Okay, that is handy. Because now I could do the point-slope form of the line. Point-slope y minus y1 uh, is equal to the slope x minus x1 okay and I didn't have to use uh, this point exactly I could have used this point as well and it would be exactly the same graph in the same equation okay and slope intercept form is even easier because I just get y equals m, our slope, x plus our b is our y-intercept, so that's just negative 2. Okay, And that's it.